You know what I mean? So Noom, to make a long story short, he, he saw me at this car show and shit. I just had started rapping and shit. And I'm on the radio station, I battled a couple dudes and make on 97.9, right? So home put me in this little show. I had to battle this dude, ate his ass up or whatever. Noon was there to see an R&B group, him and Squeak. Squeak is drummer boy members. Okay. You know so they was together. So I eat, dude, people out there, they nothing up. Now mind you, I ain't never, I don't even know what I'm doing. You see what I'm saying? So I'm coming off, off the stage, noon, I'm at the back of the stage, like, hey, bro, can we let me holler at you real quick? And they there to see an R&B group. These are, this is a true story, this is facts. Mm -hmm. They here to see an R&B group, right? But we go on right before that, so I I get I get home to be in noon, like, hey, bro, I got somebody for you to talk to. Well, we in the parking lot. I think it was at Making Mall or some shit. Shit, noon, give me the phone. I hear a nigga say, uh, oh, Pimpin! I'm like, ooh. He was like, Jazz and Faye. Like, ooh. So I'm like, Jazz and Faye? Like, Jazz, God knew who Jazz and Faye was. Mm -hmm. He was popping like a motherfucker at that time, right? So, nigga, like, hey, hey, man, the dude you with, man, he want me to meet you, and, and, and you with somebody right now that, <laughs> you know, that can, can do some shit. So, mm -hmm. you gotta be some. So, I wanna meet you. He gonna bring you to me tonight. Bruh. We parked in the park and like them niggas left the, left the car, me and my cousin nigga, and put us in the Rover, right? We coming back to the city. This the same day, right? Tip had trap music album release party that night. Uh, I can't remember that club, but it was his album release party. Bruh, them niggas laced me up. Do my first introduction to music, period. The same night we go to trap music album release party, now Tip is at the Mm -hmm. The height of his shit, like yeah. on some CI shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah. nigga got it now fucked up. I'm gonna give him it. Fucked up. I don't care who yeah. else was out. Yeah, especially that. That, that, that nigga with fucking their ass up, right? So they take me in the club. I see the nigga perform. Jazz with up with him and everything. I see him perform. He, t he turns. So I'm looking at the whole situation. I'm Mary J. Blige, all these folks in him. I see this shit. I'm like, okay, I can do that. I can do this shit. You feel me? Jazz come check me out. Look at me. Ooh. Now check this out. This is what they don't like to tell. A week later go by. I said, fuck that shit. I seen all this shit in one day. I'm like, damn, I'm back in the truck. Like, look, I told y'all nigga what I was finna do. Ooh, 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 all that little shit. Like, swear to God, it's on everything. Noon, Scoop, and Block. They end up finding out where my auntie did. Pulled up on them. White 745. I'm crawl town. Cool. Somebody in the uh, driveway. Ooh, ooh. I get over there, it's these niggas. I'm like, what the hell going on? They got my auntie, my mama, everybody in here. Like, look, bro, we finna take him. And we got some shit for him to be doing. They like, nah, we don't, we don't know y'all like that. You just can't come take my, take my son or what. We, we ain't doing it like that. So he like, block. All them on, do, no, no, give him the, you know, the voodoo. You feel? All right, get the hell on. From that day on, bro, I went to Dark Studio every night. It was me, Sierra, Lloyd, Jasper, Kerry Hills, and all these people. We used to sit in darts. Every this, these facts. Every day do music. Now, coming from where I come from, 18 years old, you put me in. It's Jazzy Faye is my producer, bro. Dallas Austin is in the other room, bro. You feel me? Noon is over everything, bro. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Like. If you don't know what I'm talking about, that's your bit. That's your problem. Yeah, you got yeah. access to You feel me? I'm, I'm talking about do your history. Do some research. Yeah. Do your history. And that speaks for itself. I came in here and turned that motherfucker up, bro. They heard the flow. That's what that that's that's the only disconnect that it be is like y'all don't want to admit all this stuff. Mm 